Taurus? What a bunch of trash. All right, so what did you win? A Taurus TX-22. <laughs> well, well, give it a shot. All right, so we got a couple different things of CCI, but I got, I like I fill this bucket up all the time with bulk stuff. So it's just a, we do just a ton of bulk federal in there, just some real cheap stuff. Subsonics, mini mags, mini mags. And I really don't know what to say about it, man. I don't have a, a long, like, review for this one uh this was kind of a uh surprise review it was just something that hey i won this let's go shoot it and of course we have a bunch of 22 ammo and we were like hey let's go burn through a bunch of ammo Brown. All right, first mag with some cheap ammo. Cheap ammo, cheap gun. Let's see if it likes it. All right, what are we trying? We are trying subs with no suppressor. Nice. Tars don't care. You know, it's actually irritating me that this is running better than my Glock 44. Like, I really do like the Glock 44, but it is kind of ammo picky. And this thing just does not care. In fact, we're gonna run some more El Cheapo Federal through it. try not to shoot the boards i don't know why i just aimed at the boards and just magged up the rest of it <laughs> yeah i'm pulling that really high I shot the board again. This thing's really I mean, what are they normally though? I mean, I know you want it you want it in a raffle, but they're like well, they're under three. Yeah, they're under three hundred bucks, I think. That is about a, 270. That's a crazy good 22 for under 300 bucks, man. Like, I love to make jokes at Taurus's expense. I've had really bad history with their revolvers. Uh, I had a G2C that was pretty good. I like the PT series, you know, Beretta clone. I, I did like the other TX22 I had, but I didn't have it very long. And this thing's pretty awesome, though. I ain't gonna lie.
Like I, I'm, I'm really liking this thing. So much quieter when you can stop the clean. I missed. Hearing all the weird ricochets and stuff, like stuff you never hear when you're wearing ear pro. Dude, a piece of lead just landed on my fingers. Like. Oh man, where'd he go? Right here. Right here. Recalled. <laughs> that went up in the air and landed on my knuckles. <laughs> um, Range trip gone wrong. Almost died. All right, we're gonna set this up and see if one of us can hit it. Oh. <laughs> I got it. I got it. <laughs> right here. I feel like straight up in the air. Yeah, we're watching the footage trying to- Oh, dude. <gasps> Is that it's it? It's not hit though. That's not, that can't be it because what i'm just gonna like shoot it right here and we'll put it back and we'll like act like i'll cut it all together are you recording right now no ah! i went up my sleeve <laughs> i think i i think i read the end of that i wasn't expecting that All right, range day with the Taurus TX-22, is it compact? Compact. So what is it, the, does it, is that just it, TX-22 compact? Yep, that's it. Sick. He won this in a raffle, and he was like, of course I would win a Taurus, I wouldn't win anything cool. And uh, I told him, I said, hey dude, the TX-22 I had was actually pretty good. And, uh, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if this one's not bad either. And we just finished a little over 500 rounds. We uh, we lost the exact count, but I knew I had close to 400 in my bucket left. And we shot another 100 rounds of CCI mini mags. We shot some uh, subsonic. We shot a lot of suppress. There will be a ton of footage for this one. Uh, we already had a little bit of a good expectation for it because of my history with the other one that I had before I ever started filming my range sessions. And uh, But this thing's actually kind of and very impressive like i think it's above what we expected out of a taurus which they seem to be doing a really good job with these 22s this is running ammo that my glock and my ruger and some of my other stuff would not run and it's pretty impressive he's brand new in the box hadn't fired it uh we opened it up put a little uh put a little bit of grease on it that was it started running it and I think besides the one kind of man-made malfunction, he was uh, he said he read where people could put, you could load 14 rounds in it fairly easily, but then it will malfunction. So we did try that. You'll see the footage right now. Oh no. What ammo was that? That was uh, the mini mags. That's mini mags? But I loaded 14 in a mag. Oh, uh, did you? It's only a 13-round mag. Oh, okay. And they said that had an issue. So you did it intentionally? Yeah. You're trying to sabotage Taurus's good name? Okay, I'm on to you. Look at the round in the mag, though. Look at it. Hold on, let me show it. See how it's nosedive in there? That's what I was saying. If, like, uh, when I had mine, if you didn't load uh, if you didn't load the mag just right, they would nosedive down and jam you up, like, constantly. Like, here. It's your switch mags. Now that's subsonics, but I load my mags correctly. <laughs> yeah, on purpose. <laughs> oh. 
That's because you didn't load that other one. That was still in the chamber. See? And we're back. <laughs> and, uh, besides that, have we had any? Have we had any malfunctions besides Zero. that induced? Other than that one that we made it happen. Yeah, I mean, this thing's running good. I really like it. I was already thinking about kind of getting one uh, that, you know, the full size that had the optics plate. I really like this compact, though, man. This thing's a lot of fun. I mean, we got a lot of footage. We got footage from 50, 60 yards. We got footage from 7, 10 yards, 15, 20. I mean, we just kind of went all up and down this field here. And you can see our targets. I mean, they are absolutely just shredded. This thing is a ton of fun. Very fun. Threaded. Has an optics plate. So we'll try to get an optic for that and see how it runs with an optic later. But uh, this thing's cool. Look how dirty that thing is. It is filthy. Look at this. Hold on. Any negatives that you have that you can think of? Honestly, no. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to think of something gun. I don't like. So I really have no room to nitpick. It runs great. Uh, I, don't know, I don't know what else to say about it. Uh, we just were like, hey, we're going to go to the range. We're going to shoot a couple of things. Bring it. You know, bring it. You haven't shot it yet. Let's go run it suppressed. And we shot this more than anything else we had out here today. This was a lot of fun. Now I'm really considering going and getting another one of these. This is really fun. I don't know. Like the grip. I think with the red dot, this would be a lot of fun. I'm curious to see if the red dot's going to like bog it down a little bit. I think it's a Hollow Sun K series in the shield uh, footprint. I do have a shield K series on my Ruger, so maybe we can swap it over one day. But every time I go to swap optics, I strip screws. So... <laughs> I don't know if I want to do that. Well, I mean, for the price of a raffle ticket, that's a steal.